What's up, everybody? This is Rocky Primus and Ziggy the Beast. And today we are doing This Is Game of Thrones Iron from Ice. It's a Telltale's game, so you know that already means uh, story driven action, whereas button presses to communicate, uh, small fight scenes or uh, glances or looks, look arounds. And it's a very good game for the five bucks that we spent in the PlayStation Store to get it. Um, so, you know Telltale's from Tales of the Borderlands and their uh, Walking Dead series. So, this is just another episodic adventure that you get to take. So, uh, before we really jump into it, I just want to say if you haven't really watched the show or you haven't read the books... You may want to do that before stepping in because the actions that you take towards these characters should be driven by some type of emotion. Besides, I'm just planning to get the trophies or the achievements, which are fairly easy. They're just story driven for the most part. So, Ziggy, go ahead, man. I'll leave it to you. Like we talked about before, man, you know, typical Game of Thrones fashion, Telltale's did very good with it. I mean, they jumped right into the plot, didn't waste any time. And, I mean, that's what we typically like as gamers. We don't like our time being wasted. We like to get straight to the meat of the game. <laughs> and they know. really just kind of, like, <laughs> started you in at a point where it's like, everything's happening. You really need to have some context behind yeah. where you start off as. So, watching a show or at least reading the books, you yep. you would have a better understanding on. You have a better understanding. That's true. What's going on and how you got to where you are and what why you're almost running for your life at one point it does help for a better understanding but for some people that feel like they don't have the time to do that this is a good game just for the epic and drama and suspense. the suspense <laughs> just for those reasons alone are good enough just to pick up the game for 4.99 in the playstation and xbox live store and it took about an hour and a half for me to go yeah, through. Yeah, it's about an hour and a half. Roughly, <laughs> and yeah. it wasn't even. It 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 really felt like I wasn't done with the game because you're not. I was like, this can't be it. This is not how you're gonna leave me. I need more more substance in what was happening. Typical because... <laughs> Game of Thrones fashion. They did pretty good with it, man. <laughs> because it very really good. just dropped off at a very high point for me. So I was ready to flip over a chair and be like, no, this is this is not where it's ending. I'm out for blood. But I really liked where they went with adding those background characters as a main character. Right. And showing those main characters as background characters and really just having small interactions with right, them. Right, right. I mean, I, I couldn't ask for anything more from this game and I really really was proud of it so i i thank you for introducing me into this series hey man we just hope uh episode two can pick up where this episode left off at so <laughs> yeah it's great it's great so it's pretty much done for us uh let's get out of here man all right see you